Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're diving into how to set up and use Google Drive on your Windows computer. Whether you're looking to store files, share documents, or collaborate with friends and colleagues, Google Drive is a fantastic tool. So let's get started. First off, what is Google Drive? Google Drive is a cloud storage service that allows you to store files online and access them from any device with an internet connection. You get 15 gigabytes of free storage, which can be used for files, photos, and Google Docs. Now let's set it up on Windows. Head over to your web browser and go to drive.google.com and download the Google Drive installer. Now let's install it. Locate the downloaded file in your downloads folder and double click to start the installation. Follow the prompts to complete the setup. It's super simple. When you open Google Drive for the first time, you'll be prompted to sign in, enter your Google account credentials, and allow Google Drive to sync your files. You can now choose which folders you want to sync between your computer and Google Drive. This is handy if you don't want to sync everything. You can click on Add Folder to add other folders not listed here. Click Next when done. You can also choose a folder to back up your photos and videos. You should now be able to access your Google Drive account from quick app icons on the Windows taskbar. Let us now set up my Drive syncing options. Select Google Drive from the taskbar and click the Settings gear at the top. Open Preferences. Here, click Google Drive from the left sidebar. You have two syncing options. Stream files in Google Drive refers to a feature that allows you to access and manage your files without fully downloading them to your device. Instead of taking up storage space on your hard drive, files are streamed directly from the cloud as you need them. This feature is particularly useful for businesses and users who work with large files or need to access multiple files without cluttering their local storage. Mirror Files in Google Drive is a feature that allows you to sync your files and folders between your Google Drive and your local storage on your computer. When you mirror files, a copy of your Google Drive files is stored on your device, ensuring that you have direct access to them even when you're offline. This feature is beneficial for users who need consistent access to their files and prefer to work offline or have limited internet connectivity. Now that you've configured the Google Drive Sync option, let's customize it 
to suit your preferences. You can set cache limit. The cache limit in Google Drive refers to the amount of temporary storage allocated for files that are accessed frequently or recently. This cache helps improve performance by allowing quicker access to these files without needing to download them from the cloud each time. This feature is particularly useful for users who access large files or use Google Drive frequently as it minimizes load times and optimizes performance. You can also set Google Drive letter. By default, Google Drive uses letter G as a virtual drive on your computer. You can change it to another letter. Google Photos offers two main upload size options for photos and videos, which can impact how much Google Drive storage is used. Original quality photos and videos are uploaded at their full resolution and quality counting against your Google Drive storage quota. Storage saver photos and videos are compressed to save space. And if you're a frequent Google Drive user, be sure to set Google Drive to open automatically when your PC starts, ensuring your files stay synced at all times. You can sync local folders on Google Drive. Under the My Laptop tab, you'll see an option to add folders from your local machine. Select the folders you want to sync with Google Drive. You can sync several PC folders to Google Drive for easy access. You can also search for your Google Drive files. When managing hundreds of files in Google Drive, you can quickly find what you need by using the search bar in the app or utilizing hotkeys for faster access. And that's it. You're now all set up to use Google Drive on your Windows PC. It's a super convenient way to manage files and access them from anywhere. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Also, hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on future tutorials. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.